Hey, come in, come in. My name is Fina. Welcome to my shop. So, how can I help you today? You want a piece tailored? Mm hmm. So, are you wanting an alteration or a bespoke piece? An alteration. Mm hmm. Okay. Of course, yeah, that's no problem. I can do that for you. So, have you got the piece that you want altered? Ah, oh, yeah. Okay, so, dress shirt. And what exactly is it that you want done? It's too big. Okay, well, that's my favourite type of alteration. It's the easiest one. <laughs> so I'm happy to do that. Okay, well, are you wanting me to do this now or at a later date? It should probably only take about 20 minutes or so. You have time? Perfect. Well, then today I'll just sort of pin you up and make my markings and then I can take it away and do the sewing in my own time and you can come pick it up later. Does that sound good? Great. Well, let's just have a look at the seams we're working with here. This should be easy enough. Alright, well, in that case, do you mind if I just pop it on you? Okay. I'm just gonna put your arms in, please. There you go. And let me just do up those buttons for you. Got the fiddly little things, aren't they? on you. Alright, so do you just want it a little more tight fitting? Mm hmm More fitted? Okay, no problem. Let me just grab some tools. I'm just gonna make some notes of what it is that you want. So it's a little too long on you as well, isn't it? Yeah, okay. So, let's take up the hem just a little bit. And the sleeves as well, right? Could you just hold out your arm for me? Just straight. We can sort of just shift these cuffs up a tiny bit. That should be no problem. Okay. So, cuffs being taken in a bit. And then around the chest. Okay. We'll take it in a little bit here. I can remove a bit of the fabric from the back here and just tighten it up a bit and then as for the lower torso <laughs> I think we can just put in a couple of darts into the back so that's just going to make it sit a bit more fitted to your body How does that sound? Good Well, of course I'll put all the pins in and you can take a look and see how you like it. So, that was taking in the hem and the cuffs, taking a little out the back, and adding in some darts. But the collar, that fits okay. Yeah, that 
looks fine to me. Okay, so how about we start fitting you in? Just grab my tape measure and then my tools. <laughs> so I'm just going to take a few measurements just in case any of the pins slip so that I know where to put them back. Let's start with your hem, shall we? So, are you wanting it to sit sort of, how do you like it, sort of here? Is that alright? I think that that sort of looks like a more appropriate length. Mm -hmm. Great. So we're going to take off just about three inches or so. the arms, the cuffs. Could you just hold your arm out again for me? Okay, thank you. Now this is only just a little too long, isn't it? Maybe we can just take it back. How do you like that? So that's two inches. Good. take a measurement around your chest, if you don't mind. I'm just going to scooch around, sorry. Okay. So I'll only have to take a little bit out, I think, for that. And then your darts, I'm just going to pin those in to see what looks good. Let me just <laughs> roll my measuring tape back up. in just to hold the fabric in a position that I think looks good. So, let's start by pinning up your hem. Okay. So, doing this just helps me sort of imagine how it's going to look as a finished product. And obviously, it helps you imagine the same. So you can tell me if you like the sort of completed look or if there's anything you want to change before I sew it. So let's just pin up that hem first. And I'm just going to make a couple marks as well. Got my <laughs> dressmaker's chalk, so don't you worry. This is not gonna stain your shirt. It comes right off again with a little brush. But I'm just gonna make some markings where I want to have the new hem. So let me just sketch some of those in. lines there just gives me something to follow. It's a bit 
simple. So for example, I can measure these three inches all the way around and then mark on where it goes and then pin it along that line. So measure out that distance and then we can draw it on. Okay. Add some more around the back. Sorry, I'm just gonna <laughs> lean over a bit. of that hem, and then we're almost done. Okay. Now I can get to pinning around the rest of that. Okay. So. Now you can sort of start to see what it might look like when it's done. So you can see it sort of sits a little better on your body already, just if you were to have it untucked of course. It doesn't hang at quite that same awkward length. If you take a look at that new length on yourself, how do you feel about that? Does that sit in the length that you're happy with? Or would you like me to take it up more or let it out? Are you happy with that? Good, so am I. <laughs> I think that looks a bit better already. So, next up let's do your cuffs. If you'd hold your arms out again for me, this side first. Thanks. Okay. So I'm going to do the same thing again and sort of measure out how far I'm going to take it in. And then make some markings with my chalk. So, what did we say? Two inches for this. mark out this time, of course. Okay. So, I'm just going to undo your cuff a bit further so that I can <laughs> have the space to fold and pin up. There you go. So now let's pin that how we'd like it. Do that button back up so you can get a good look at how it now looks. Gosh, these buttons are even worse than the ones on the shirt. <laughs> there you go. 
Okay, so how does that feel on your arm now? If you stretch it all the way out and make sure that it looks right at every angle. Mm hmm. That's good. Great. So then let's do your other one with the same measurements. So this arm. Let's of course start with our marking out again. Your arm isn't getting too tired. I'll try to be quick. <laughs> okay. Let's get those pins in you. Again, probably won't need that many. Again, I'll do that little button up again. So you can give it a test run. Okay, there you go. So, it should be just the same as the other side, but still, just have a little look for me. Make sure you like it. Yeah, perfect. Well, that leaves us with what? So this time, I'm going to put in the darts, but I think I also want to just take out a tiny bit of fabric. So there's no seam down the back, is there? No. So I'll take that fabric out from the sides. So let me just my pins aside for a moment and I'm just going to make some markings again, okay? So I hope you don't mind, I'm going to be sort of pinching around your side a bit. <laughs> I hope you're not ticklish. Okay. So I think we're going to be splitting the amount taken between the two sides, obviously, so it's still nice and symmetrical, but it doesn't need to be much, does it? Because you only need about this much taken in. Does that feel comfortable for you? It's not too tight? Good. I think that's still a loose enough fit that it doesn't look, you know, skin tight, but much nicer, sort of fitted style. Okay, let's mark that in then. There. And the same on this side, so take those measurements. And then we'll replicate them on this side.
marked up. So let's pin it in now so you can see how it will really look. And of course, since I'm still going to add a couple darts in the back, this isn't the finished fit, <laughs> so keep that in mind. So, let's just pop a couple more pins in there. Okay. And if you could stay still, please. I don't want to prick you in the side. looks a lot better, doesn't it? So now we just need to pinch in that back for that nice sort of tailor-made fitted look. And we're finished. Okay, so a dart, basically, if you don't already know, is just where we sort of take in some of the fabric, like a triangle, so imagine a triangle like this, and then it gets sewn together like that. So it's sort of pinched in the places that you want it to be, and it just fits it that bit closer to your body, okay? So I'm going to do two sort of triangles down your back. I'm just going to draw them on, and then I'll pin them together so we can see how it will look when it's sewn up. start with my little pencil to draw on those triangles. So I'm going to start over on this side. Don't mind if I scooch a little closer. Let's draw those on. Now yeah, this is still rough, obviously. I'm sort of experimenting with the placement of them. Do the same on the other side because I want it to be nice and symmetrical, of course. Okay, so let's see what that looked like if it was put together. Is that a little too tight? Looking at it now, it doesn't give you a whole lot of wiggle room. How does it feel? A bit too much? Okay. Let me just readjust that then. Make it a tiny bit skinnier so that less fabric ends up being taken out. So, like this. Is that a little better? That looks better to me. How do you feel? Got enough room? <laughs> okay, great. Well, then I'll get to pinning them up. And then you can, you know, give it a bit of a twirl. <laughs> Alright.
this one here. Okay, and let's do your other side. to do to you, isn't it? Let's take a look at how it sits on you now. Yeah, okay, that looks much better, doesn't it? And your collar. Yeah, that's still okay there. So, how do you like it? Just how it's sort of sitting on you now? Obviously, It'll be a little neater once it's properly sewn, but is this sort of fit and length okay for you? Yep. Okay. I think that sits very nicely. So, put these away. Be relatively quick. It seems like quite some simple fixes. So, would you like to just come in tomorrow and pick it up? I can do this tonight. Perfect. All right. Well, let's get this off you then. <laughs> Let me help you with those buttons. Alright, so I'll be precious with this so I don't knock away any of the pins. So let's leave that there for now. So you're going to come get it tomorrow. So can I take just a name and a phone number in case I need to contact you? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Number. Okay. Perfect. Well, I'll take payment when you come and pick it up. So I think that's everything done. So is there anything else that you needed while you're here, or is it just that shirt? Great. Well, in that case, thank you for coming in, and I'll see you tomorrow. All right? Bye. Have a good day. A huge thank you to all of my patrons who continue to support my channel, including my mid REM cycle tier patrons Max, Belly Button, Classy Cass, Ola, Skulls, and new edition Mark. Welcome. <laughs> I'm so happy that you're all here, and it really does make a huge difference to my channel, and I'm very, very thankful to each and every one of you, and I hope that you all have a wonderful night's sleep tonight.